In 2017, 55.7 million passengers traveled through San Francisco International Airport. We have on average 150,000 people traveling through the airport every day. Flying can be stressful, so here at SFO we've introduced therapy dogs called the Wag Brigade to make flying more enjoyable. The Wag Brigade is a partnership between the airport and the San Francisco SPCA's Animal Assisted Therapy Program to bring trained and certified therapy animals into the airport, into the terminals, to make passenger travel more enjoyable. I'm Jennifer Kazarian and I work in Airport Guest Services here at San Francisco International Airport. The idea for therapy dogs in airports got started the day after 9-11. An employee at San Jose Mineta Airport brought his dog to work, his therapy dog to work, the day after 9-11, and he was able to see how his dog was able to relieve passengers' jitters. When we first launched the program back in 2013, our main goal was to de-stress our passengers. However, what we quickly found is that our animals were helping us find a way to connect with our passengers. We find that there are a lot of people traveling through the airport who are really missing their pets, who are on the road a lot, can't have pets, and we come into contact actually with a lot of people who have recently lost pets. I love the WAG Brigade. I left my dogs at home and I've had a long layover, so it's very nice to see them and be able to be here. One of my favorite parts about the program is walking into the terminals and seeing everybody look up from their devices. Today you find everybody's interacting on either their cell phone or their laptop computer. So what we're finding is we can walk into the terminal with a dog or a pig and people start to interact with each other again. And it's on a different level. It's more of an emotional level. I just got off 11 and a half hour flight from Beijing and I've got to still connect through Denver to get to Des Moines. So it's nice to have this little distraction in the middle of it. We look for WAG Brigade handlers who are comfortable interacting with the traveling public and who are also comfortable in stressful situations. I really like coming to the airport. It's a lot of fun because the people that you talk to generally are people who are missing their dogs. All of our WAG Brigade dogs are required to complete their certification process with the SFSPCA prior to coming to the airport for an evaluation. They are also required to complete a canine good citizen test. Uh, we look for animals who have experience working with other organizations, such as hospitals, pediatric units in those hospitals. We want to be sure that the animals that we are bringing into the airport are good with children and are also good with some of our senior travelers. I think Toby really likes meeting kids. That is his favorite thing, and um, he likes to pet them, have them pet him and come up to him, and he really loves the kids. Our WAG Brigade animals can be spotted wearing custom vests. All of the vests have custom embroidery that reads, pet me, and they also have custom patches, one from the SFSPCA and one from SFO. There's never a day that repeats itself. There's never an encounter that repeats itself. We get to do a maximum good in a relatively little, stre small stretch of time. And I've just met some amazing people who've been thrilled to have the interaction. The dogs are here seven days a week. We have 20 dogs. Each dog comes for a two-hour shift. You know, there's a lot of stress when people are traveling, so having these animals around, you know, kind of eases the stress and causes people to relax a little bit before they're, you know, about to board on their flight. So I think it's great. One of our dogs has special needs, and that's Tristan. Tristan had a spinal injury, and so Tristan wears wheels to get around. We have to park in the garage, and then I have to get all his gear together because he has the wheels, he has special shoes, the harness. So we kind of get to get um, it all together in the parking lot and then we get on the air train. But he loves it. He also loves all the staff at the airport as well. Little kids love him because he's a little lower to the ground. So he's easy to reach and he's got this big furry head that they get to pet and they love that. Tristan doesn't seem to mind at all. Tristan is probably one of the happiest dogs in the world. 
Many people are nervous when they travel, so seeing the dogs is just a wonderful uh, relief. What I absolutely love most about it is the look on people's faces. So whenever they're stressed and flying is stressful these days, you get these wonderful smiles. I'm the human mom of Lilu the pig. She is San Francisco's first therapy pig and world's first airport therapy pig. Lilu joined the WAG Brigade about a year and a half ago as our first non-canine member. And Lilu has been quite a favorite, quite a social media favorite. We got certified with SPCA, San Francisco's SPCA. It's part of their animal assisted therapy program. So we started volunteering at hospitals, retirement homes, schools. And then SFO WAG Brigade invited us uh, to join the program here at the SFO. And we did about over a year and a half ago, and it's been fantastic. Our volunteer visits last about an hour, hour and a half, sometimes two hours. It does take us a little bit longer to get out of the terminal because we still get a lot of attention and a lot of people that want to interact with Lilo. I feel really honored to be part of the WAG Brigade. It's really very special to meet so many people and to make so many people feel happy and the people that work here. It's been a great experience for me and I think a great experience for Toby. The WAG Brigade has been extremely successful. It's one of the airport's most popular programs. So the next time you're at SFO, if you see the WAG Brigade, stop by and say hi.